Okay. Liam, first se um, pre-season workout, how's it gone, do you think? Uh, first off, totally different from this time last year. I said the uh, crowd were great, atmosphere was good. It was good, Lovely wasn't to it? See tonight, everyone yeah. back. Uh, it just seemed a totally different place. Um, I've got to thank Blackpool as always for coming. Uh, Crits does it every year, and you know we, they don't have to. And especially after the trouble last year, they've gone out really out the way to make it sure. And it's always a great fixture. It's tough. Uh, even this year, like we've got the four big clubs in straight off on the back. But as I said, uh, nice of the, the fans to see some of the new players. Um, hopefully, there'll be one or two more. So, all positive, really good, um, again, couldn't have asked more from them in pre-season up to now. Uh, obviously, they haven't done an awful lot with the balls, uh, we did train on Wednesday night, full session with the balls, so this is really the first mm. first go, uh, got Tramia Tuesday, but fair play to Harry Flowers, fair play to Matty Thompson, people like that who have got through 90 minutes straight away, mm. uh, it's good, so got genuine good competition in the squad, um, as I said. Still would like at least at least one yeah. big more, and then we'll have a look at the players who are outside as well. Yeah. We always say that you know it's getting the the minutes into the players in it in these games. The results don't matter. We we don't really bother about the results. It's, it's getting the minutes in and getting the lads working together. Well, it, it, if you think we probably played best in the first half, yeah. coming three 0 yeah. down. So uh, second half, I was worried when you were putting young lads on. Uh, but listen, they acquitted themselves well. Um, you know, 16 year old on. Yeah. Uh, big lad, isn't he? Yeah, 17 year olds on. So it's good. It's good. Great, great for them. If you're thinking like I'm thinking of my when I was 16, 17, the thoughts of playing against Blackpool. You know, I said they've got some good, really good players. The ones they've signed. And, you know, one or two we've come across in our level, whether it was Doug or Jake Beasley or um, the kid we signed from Kings Lynn. All, all good players all around the pitch so to compete and they had a full 45 you know full it and then yeah. swap the whole team over so you know it, it's massive credit to our lads at how well they keep themselves in shape uh, so no really pleased yeah. you mentioned at the start I think we, we should thank the crowd specifically shouldn't we tonight because they, they got behind the lads and lovely atmosphere again that's what we want all season yeah, isn't it just get back to what we are you know a good club uh, great fans all on the one page, all having a go, and I get, yeah, I, I understand people say it's to do with results, yeah, I 100% get that. I said, but it makes an awful lot easier if we're all pulling in the one, in one direction. Uh, so, nice atmosphere, I so really, really enjoyed it. By the way, the people who've done the pitch, the pitch is brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Uh, so they said yeah. in about three weeks' time, when we start proper, it's going to be absolutely perfect. Yeah. It's still a bit to, to work on, it, but it's it will be. And I said, you know, I said people can look at the the new signers and go home. And I said, the first time I've seen Freddie Sass, first time I've seen Matty Thompson, Chris Renshaw, Harry Flowers. About the twenty-seven times signed Marcus. <laughs> uh, Sam Billington was impressive. Very uh, So. You know, I'll probably miss someone and then I'll be thinking. But Josh Amani looks in really good condition. Uh, he needs a really big season for him. Uh, like I said, we've got threats all over there. Uh, we've got Jordan. Jordan's still a couple of weeks away. Mm -hmm. uh, but he's been training during pre season, but he needs an injection in his knee. So that'll take him down, but hopefully we'll be ready for the start of the season. Yeah, just one quick final word about the opening fixture. That's quite an attractive one for us all, isn't it, to have Warrington at home on the first well, game of the season? Uh, listen, it's different for me, but Bees has done a fabulous job to yeah. get Warrington, and, and so has Toby, the chairman, who's, who's a top bloke. What they've done is incredible. Obviously, Warrington will always mean an awful lot for me because yeah. I started my career there. Uh, and, and if it wouldn't have been for Warrington Town, I'd never have moved into the football league. And you know, for, for me, you know, I always want them to do well. I want them to win every game, apart from the place I've got. Yeah, brilliant. Thanks, Liam. Thanks.